Well, well, a witcher. Looking for a barber? Well, you found one. Welcome. I'll plowing shave the gentleman's noggin for half price. Give me a haircut. As uh, long as your hands aren't too shaky. This is not what I wanted. What do you mean, not what you wanted? Are you cut and quaffed? You are. And even as even can be, I'd say. This is not the look I wanted. And this is not the fate I wanted. I was to be an alderman in Mahakan. Instead, I shave and cut traps and ragamuffins. Life deals what it deals. You shrug and you take it. Welcome back to ye. Satisfied customer always comes by again, hey? Eh? Give me a haircut. Uh, as long as your hands aren't too shaky. So long. Greetings. What have you got to pull? And how much do you need? What makes you think I need a loan? Taint a man that don't from time to time. And you don't look nor smell flush with coin. Just so happens I'm doing fine at the moment. Then maybe you'd like a look at what the less fortunate have forfeited. Show me what you have in stock.
So long. Oi, Coca! I'm a witcher! Hi, yeah! Coca with a live round. Imagine that. Vile times when back. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. White Wolf, they call you. You stand accused of offending religious sentiment. We've orders to take you in for interrogation. Surrender your weapons. This is a misunderstanding. But fine, take them. Though I'll need a receipt. I wouldn't want to lose anything. Yeah. Drawn it up for you now. Remember the preacher who spoke of witches and witchers? A man you humiliated before his faithful. He asked that we administer a sacrament on his behalf. Your last rites. I've had enough of living. Huh? Ooh. Where are you, Rootlin? Come closer. Don't be shy. We'll find out everything. White one, take a gander at it. How'd you discover it was just sitting cool? Like Zed's inside and in hot water. Gotta find another way in.
find it? No. Oh, Duke will be peeved we didn't get his head to spill where he keeps a ledger. I tried, didn't I? Might have pressed him too hard. Shit. Well, at least we got the Isengrim card. Greetings. Time to shine! Get him! Not bad. This card's worth. Ledger might be worth snooping they around were looking for. for something. They were looking for something. They were looking for something. They were looking for something. Hmm. Must be the names of people Zed sold cards to. Zoltan ought to have a look at this. Taken the city. Excellent question. I believe I can clear the mystery up for you. War requires resources wherewithal. Novigrad's a large port with a powerful fleet and a treasury overflowing with gold. All that makes it a tasty morsel. Tempting for both Redania and Nilfgaard. I understand. The city's walls are high, its arsenals are full of weapons. Then you don't understand much. True, a siege be a long and grueling affair, but. More importantly, everything that's valuable in Novigrad could disappear faster than a mayfly's dream. The big fours made it known that should things come to a head, the fleets flamble, and any assault on the city sure to touch off riots, during which the church's coffers could very well be looted bare. So, anyone wanting Novigrad's wealth, its ships, has no choice but to deal with its criminal underworld. What can you tell me about Novigrad's underworld? We've got one concept for you. The Big Four. Siggy Reuven, the King of Beggars, Cleaver, and Horse Son Junior. What do you call a triumvirate, but with four individuals? No idea. Well, there are four, and they've carved the city into spheres of influence. Nothing happens without them knowing about it and approving it. Rumor is Horsan recently quarreled with the others, but I know nothing more. Novigrad doesn't seem like a safe place anymore. What's keeping you here? I was keen on starting my own enterprise, but nothing came of it. Nevertheless, I took on some debt. Got to pay it back now. I'd like to blame it on the war or human treachery, but the truth is, I've got my own thick skull to blame. Rather not dwell on it, Geralt, if you don't mind. About those cards. You got them? Got the Isengrim card. So it here. Ha! The sea hills are beautiful. Zed give you much trouble? Zed's dead. I ran into his murderers. Won't cry over spilt Zed. What about the other cards? Zoltan. Sure this business isn't getting a little too dangerous? I mean, men are dying over these cards. Just Zed. And believe you me, he wasn't an innocent bystander. Besides, I'm certain he snuffed his killers out on the spot, so why worry? Tell me about the other cards instead. Didn't find the other cards. Fuck! 
Bogar must have sold them. Listen, Godzed's ledger. Show me. Hmm. Entries show him selling the cards to Caesar Bilson and Ravi. Eh, could have been worse. We need to pay him a visit. Who's Caesar Bilson? Cleaver's Club. A decent fellow once, but so high and mighty now you can't drink with him. I wouldn't go fishing. Fishing? We met at the Angler's Club. The pride of the Ponta. But Caesar don't show around there no more. So caught up in his new role, he almost never leaves his house. At least we won't have to run around town looking for him. Ravi, who's he? A common card sharp and a swindler. Boggles my mind where he got the coin for the Natalis card. Ever since I gave him a smack and things between us have been frosty. So we'll have to see him alone. Sultan seems awful important to you. I'll try to get you those cards. Thanks, get out. We can see Caesar together. Meet me outside his townhouse. Gaudiest eyesore in Hierarch Square. He had the facade painted gold. And if you want to see Ravi first, I'd look for him at the Golden Sturgeon if I were you. All right. See you later. Got no need to push foot around with Ravi. Beat him about the ears a bit. He'll cave. Well... Good luck to you, Geralt. Something stinks. Decomposing flesh. Human flesh. Written mutant. Join us, please. Ravi loves company. Look how happy he is to see us. You happy, Ravi? Sure, he'd be happier if you stopped digging the point of that dagger in his back. Oh, you're just saying that because you don't know the situation. Our mutual friend Ravi was just about to play for his life and. Uh, Oh, you got the card. What else do you want? If you'd just given it up, instead of trying to cheat us, we'd be out of your hair already. As it is, that's all your fingers broke. So, it seems the Witcher will have to play for you. Sound good? <laughs> See? Ravi's on board. What do you say? We add some spice to the game. Raise the stakes. Ravi's life and the Natalis card. Fancy that? Agreed. <laughs> and here I thought you'd be no fun at all. Let's play, let's play!
Yes! Curb your enthusiasm, mate. And sit still or you'll hurt yourself. But... But he won! So? Now we'll play something else. Thanks. Don't know how I'll repay you. The tallest card will do just fine. Oh, yeah. Uh, maybe you prefer some other? Got a whole array you might like. I'm in a hurry. The Natalis card, of course, here. Non-human, are you? Look for your kind beyond. What'll it be? What are you serving? Farewell. Ah, you're here. How'd you make out with Ravi? Got the Natalis card. Excellent! Now we've just Caesar Bilzen to fleece, and we'll be home free. We'll do this. I'll chat him up while you sneak upstairs and search his cabinet of curiosities. Certainly keeps the card there. Can't we just buy the card off him? Doesn't that sound simpler? If I had a coin to spare, I'd sod off to Povis. So I'd Caesar never sell Fungilla. But don't you worry. He won't lose out on the deal. Got a bottle of Mahakam and spirit for him. A taste of the Motherland's finest is worth more to an expatriate than some silly card. Thought you said Caesar doesn't drink. No. I said it's hard to have a drink with him on account of his already leaving home. Also, why he's like to get pished as a priestess real quick. Three rounds and you could walk out with everything in that cabinet while singing the three maids of Vigo Varo at the top of your lungs. So what's in this cabinet? Ah, no man knows. You'll be the first to see it. I suspect it's either to do with buggery or metallurgy. But you can tell me once we're done. Let's go! Chivi! Caesar Bilzen! I remember our quarrel about who's king of the Ponta. The Pipes king of the Ponta. Ah, uh, well, you see, uh, I've come to convince you it's the catfish. And I do not come empty handed. Who's he? Well, well that's, that's Geralt. Does say uh, Geralt fish? Yeah. Cast an earthworm the other day. Caught this huge perch. And the Ponta! You betcha! Can't listen to this hogwash sober. Come in! So what the Zanders are eager biters if they taste like shite and soapy water? That's because you're about as good a cook as a goat's arse as a clarinet. Just recently, 
I took some fresh time. <laughs> and it tasted like time flavor shit. <laughs> Shut it. So, recently, I, I took this time. Get out? Care to chime in? How's Xander taste to you? Happen to like Xander. Cook a witcher! But you shoving them potions, shit's a delicacy to use. <laughs> a witcher? Never mentioned he was a witcher. Well then, did you hear Vibo Batilda last cast a pea and caught a young pike? Ah, cocksuckers lying like always. Haunter Pike aren't so dumb witted to go after his rotten peas. You need life bait. Or night crawlers, though the pike aren't as eager. Don't know why. Once, dug up a crawly so fat and lovely I started drooling. Would have eaten it myself? I'm uh, not so sure. Geralt, what are you and your pals? He's up at Cair Morhead. Live bait. You see, Chibi? He'll make a good angler yet. In some 50, 60 years. <laughs> we'll wait and see. Get out. Go fetch us another bottle. Right. Can see the bottom of this one. Sure, blame that on us too. So, when are we gonna go noodling for catfish? I'm done fishing with ye. You forget what happened last time. What about last time? Knife looks like it's attached to the tabletop. Drawer is open. Dining set from which Emperor Amir ate during his coronation ceremony. A statuette of a man wasn't carved but produced using magic. Shame I can't ask Triss about it. Here's Fringilla. Rope with which Stefan Skellen was hanged. Joachim de Ved Skull. Hmm, pretty grim curiosity. Full armor of the 7th Dareland Brigade. Excellent condition. Bells in there. We have a message for you from the boss. Message? What kind of message? Mr. Cleaver's very unhappy. Uh, now, just a minute. If any discrepancies have cropped up in the books, I can explain everything. Too late. Grab him. And you two, get lost. Leave him alone. Cleaver will pay extra for killing the witcher. Well, up to you, lads. Haven't you got all day? I feel for your man that you bore you all. 
to Cleaver. I'd recommend a letter. Right. Got a pack. Good luck then. Farewell. Oh. Ah, you've a soft heart after all, Geralt. Oh, by the by, splendid job with that last one. Blood splatter nearly hit the ceiling. Looked through Caesar's cabinet upstairs. And? No wonder he wasn't eager to show it off. Nilfgaardian armor, a portrait of Emir. Joachim de Vet's skull, Vatier de Rideau's dagger, the rope they hanged Skellen with. Oh, oh, oh shit! Disgusting fellow. I think I shook hands with him. Uh, but did you happen to take the rope? I know a few would pay a tidy sum for it. Some go in for that sort of thing. No. Ugh, if you say so. Also found a figurine. Nilfgaardian soldier. Magic spell on it of some sort, but I can't tell what kind. Triss ought to know. Good idea. Take it by your house when I get a chance. So, got the full set of cards. What now? Now we collect a shite load of coin for them. Let's go. The exchange. We should do it right quick. Afraid your client might change his mind? Oh, I'm more likely to. Had so many buyers for these cards, I felt like the bell of the ball. So the buyer, who is he? A friend of a friend. Don't know much about him, but he's of juke silk. No doubt about that. Hmm. You know me, Geralt. I'm not prejudiced against anyone. As long as they pay. Ah, at last. I fear the body is gone cold. What is this? Your would-be buyer handed us his coin and departed. More or less in that order. Now, the cards, please. I trust obtaining them wasn't too troublesome. Try it and find out. <laughs> you wish me to try? I'm not as foolish as Earl. You ought to know that by now. Get to work, boys. The dwarf I wish to have alive. I must have a chat with him. Doing it. Geralt, bastards getting away with my coin. Damn it, with our coin. Chase the horse and I'll tend to the others. What? Can't understand a word. Can't get away, Duke. Might as well stop.
surviving drowners? <laughs> you could use a witcher. Ha ha. Highly amusing. If... If I give you the coin, will you leave me be? Yeah, you can go, if you're able. Ha! What are my chances with these wounds? Not high. So long. So, you get them? You get the coin? Yes. And what about Duke? Finish him off? No, I let him go. Oh, I knew I should have gone with you. You know he has it in for me. You'll be doubly determined now. Doubt it. Think he's likely to quit the business. If he gets out of there alive. Well, Geralt, what's your preference? Coin or cards? I'd never have managed without you, so you choose. If you want gold, it's not a problem. I'll find another buyer for these cards in a flash. Kinda curious how the cards might serve me. Excellent! I'll take the coin to the King of Beggars right away. Surprise the prick. Good luck, Sultan. Thanks, Geralt. And remember, the catfish is the king of the Ponta. Mm-hmm. 